and welcome to another episode of Back From The Future. We, we like to talk about technology from the past, present and future. Now today we are going to be doing an unboxing review of the Logitech Unifying USB Dongle. Now I'm sure of you, uh, some of you who are watching this video have got a Logitech mouse or keyboard for example I've got this Logitech K400 and for whatever reason I've gone around um, someone's house and um, I've taken the keyboard with me uh, along with my laptop and for whatever reason I've actually lost uh, the Unifying dongle. Now luckily uh, Logitech is one of those companies that supply spare Unifying dongles. So in this video I'm going to show you how to uh, basically pair this uh, USB dongle to your computer and it is very very simple. Now the great thing about this um, dongle is it allows you to connect six different devices so you could uh, have basically um, one of these keyboards in your uh, office and one at home and all you do is you take your laptop and you wouldn't have to take the keyboard with you or the mouse with you you just take it take it to work and switch the keyboard on switch the laptop on and it should connect no problem so you could have up to six or say three keyboards and three mouses scattered around maybe your workplace your home friend's house whatever doesn't really matter so let's get the show on the road and uh, unbox this uh, device so if we open it here we just uh, simply slide it out and there you have the dongle in my hand right here the thing you should notice about uh, these dongles is it has a little sign a little orange unifying sign. Now one thing to remember is that with the Logitech uh, unifying USB you can only use it with Logitech products. As far as I know you can't use it with any other products or brands or names other than Logitech. Uh, also with the Logitech mouses some of the um, cheaper mice don't have this U unifying USB uh, that comes with it. They have a separate little USB that only works with that mouse. Now if you lose that um, dongle you can get one of these and it will work with it which is brilliant. It'd be nice though if they did have this uh, come with all their cheap budget mice but unfortunately it is what it is right. So without further ado I'm gonna I've got this USB extension that is connected to my computer and all you have to do is let's get this the right way around plug this in like that there you go that registered with my computer now I've got my K400 uh, keyboard ready I'm just going to turn on the on screen recording Right now, I'm going to share my screen and I'm going to show you basically how to um, set this keyboard up. Also, just wanted to let you know, on this package it actually comes with the website uh, that you should uh, connect to in order to download the software for the unifying USB uh, dongle. So, without further ado, Let's go to Google. Already got the link. Now we'll be posting the link in the description. So we go to download now. It looks like this came out in 2010. Wow, that is old. 
so we'll download right that downloaded yes I accept I have no idea what I'm accepting but this is then user license agreement right that's finished right here we go plug it forget it add to it you are now ready to use your Logitech Unifying Receiver and you can pair up to six compatible wireless mice, keyboards and other devices uh, in one single Unifying Receiver. Well, we know that. So we'll go next. Right, locate the on-off slider pictured below, move the slider off, then on and then wait for the device to be paired. So we are going to now turn on Oh, the keyboard. We're going to now turn it on. Oh, right. I've jumped the gun here. And it's already detected it straight away. It's detected it as a we have detected your keyboard K400 Plus. So it's detected it straight away. Please confirm whether you can see the characters just typed. We will go yes. Your, K4, your keyboard K400 Plus is now ready to use. Right, okay. Now you can finish or pair another device. Um, so we'll go finish. We'll close that. Now, the interesting thing is if you want to unpair a keyboard, I will show you how to quickly, or a, div, or a mouse or whatever, we will um, quickly show you how to do that. So to unpair a device, here we go. So it actually gives you pair a new device or unpair. Right now, and that's just unpaired the device and then you can then pair your keyboard to a different um, unifying USB receiver if you have one. Um, and um, that's about it. I think this is an amazing product. Uh, it's, it's so helpful if you manage to um, lose it, uh, your original unifying receiver it's so handy that you can order another one i bought mine off ebay for less than 10 pounds and uh, what more can i say it's as easy and as simple as i've just shown you here so i hopefully you've enjoyed this video if you liked this video please feel free to subscribe to our channel press the bell notification button and get notified when a new video comes out. Please leave a thumbs up. If you enjoyed this video, please leave comments and let us know what your thoughts and suggestions are for future videos. And we will see you in the future, if there is one.